Hey there guys, Skippy here from Skippy6 Gaming coming to you with a quick tutorial. I think I'm going to do this one in a couple minutes. We are going to have a simple and easy on and off fireplace. It's as easy as that. You know, do what you want to do. Turn it off. Turn it back on. It's easy enough. Look at that. Pretty simple. I know for my builds uh, that come with regards to fireplaces and things like that. I always use stone brick. I don't know why. That's what I feel. Uh, what be. So basically, let's go. What for this build, guys, you're going to need seven redstone dust, two dispensers, one redstone torch, two buttons, two iron bars, two item frames, two sticky pistons, two netherrack, and uh, some fire charges. That's the, I guess, no using flint and steel on this one, and you're going to need blocks of choice. For me, I'm using brick. It's up to you. I'll leave that up to you anyway. So let's start this build. It's pretty straightforward build, guys. Dig yourself a too deep, too, uh, I guess too long if you really wanted to look at it that way, and four wide hole in the ground. Uh, very simple stuff. Grab your sticky pistons and go to the back side here. Put one here. One here, one here. Grab yourself a block of choice. Put a block of choice right here. Grab yourself your redstone dust and put it right here, here, and here. Grab yourself a block of choice. Put your block of choice right there. Grab yourself a redstone torch on the side of that one. If you see the pistons go up, that means you did it right. Go ahead and put redstone dust here. So now this is where the fun part comes in. Grab yourself some right there. Nether rack looks good, looks good. So basically grab your block of choice whatever it's going to be since i already made one out of bricks i'm going to make this one out of uh mossy stone so let's do it um so the first block that's going to be seen is this block right here so let's go ahead and put it right there and then once we've done that it's actually a pretty straightforward little path on the way out to this guy what we're going to do is oh i think i did it right i did it right for sure so basically what we're going to do is we want to put our dispensers right above this, so build this guy up here, and then put one right here. Once that's done, grab yourself your dispensers. Shouldn't have taken rid of my iron bars. Horrible. So you want your dispensers facing down on top of these nether rack. Pretty simple. Go like this. Crouch place by pushing in the right trigger down and down now you're gonna to want to put some fire charges in it guys this is only one you know two fire charges per use not that bad I would just throw a stack half of it in each one that'll last you a fair amount of uses 16 uses um, and you know what a couple blaze rods here and there isn't the hardest thing in the world go ahead and go over here grab yourself another block of choice I'm just gonna use this even though you guys aren't gonna see what I do right here is good grab yourself Put that block under this one here, leaving yourself that little divot. Put a redstone dust right here, and then crouch place redstone dust on top of these guys. Once you're done that, you're pretty good to go. You could go ahead and put a button here. This button here is going to do that, which is pretty good. Not bad at all, not bad at all. And then what we are going to want to do is put a button up here that's going to do that. And then once you do that, you do that, you do that, and you're good. The rest of it's design, guys. So what I'm going to do is we're going to make this one uh, mossy cobblestone, which is what I always call it, uh, fireplace. So let's go ahead and uh, close these guys in. The two iron bars, again, that's your call. You could mix and match with a few different things. I feel really solid that iron bars looks the best. I tried all the different ones. And as you can see, that looks good. We'll go ahead and grab, you know what we could do? We could put some chiseled stone brick in there. Yeah, boy. Uh, this guy right here. Let's go ahead and put this guy here. And once you do that, the last thing that I'm going to add is the item frames. I always add item frames on stone buttons. This actually looks pretty cool, guys. Uh, I'm going to go back here, and I'm going to seal it off with green and see if that makes it look any... Uh, cooler okay so now it's closed off we're good it already works but basically what we're gonna want here is ooh, this could be like a jumble jungle temple fireplace well there you go guys pretty easy build pretty straightforward we'll go good in any of your survival worlds anybody can make it pretty pretty simple okay guys don't forget to smash that like don't forget as well to subscribe to see what tutorial i make tomorrow i do have 670 tutorials on my playlist holy cannoli so uh smash the like subscribe share the video and i'll see you tomorrow